Temperatures are occurring anywhere around town. We've got 35 degrees over at City Airport, 33 for our friends and neighbors over in Mount Clemens, friends over in uh, Ann Arbor, just one degree above freezing right now. But at least it remains dry for all your evening plans. Not as dry as we get into Monday and early next week. We'll talk about that in a second. Winds right now around five miles per hour. Still doing the thing of lowering those wind chills. Wind chills right now easily running in the 20s. That's how cold it feels outside if your skin is not protected. But there is some good news in the forecast. Temperatures will be a little bit higher. I mean, out to our west, it's 39 degrees in Des Moines, 48 in uh, Sioux Falls, South Dakota. Those temperatures are on the way for this weekend. Now, we'll continue to have dry conditions. Snowflakes all someplace else, at least for now, as we go through Friday night and Saturday. Saturday, we'll have partly to mostly sunny skies, and that will allow our temperatures to get closer to around 40 degrees. Then we're watching this. I've got an area of low pressure that arrives by late Sunday and into Monday with an Arctic blast behind it. First, bring some possible snow that will accumulate at least an inch or so. So we got to be careful driving again on Monday, Veterans Day, and then even lower temperatures again as we go into the early and middle part of next week. So 25 degrees overnight. Sunset has already occurred at 519. We're looking at 41 degrees for a high tomorrow. Good weather at least for the football game over in East Lansing as well. 47 on Sunday. There is the chance of that snow shower activity on Monday before it gets even colder. Yeah, With highs okay. only in the 20s, it looks like, on uh, Tuesday. It just doesn't feel like we've had a whole lot of buffer time to move I into know, this. It's still <laughs> autumn. Just flip the switch and we're right into winter. Sure did. All right.